Good day YouTube, this is Jay Moneyway following Ford Financial. Just an update here on uh, IPOE, uh, Social Capital. Uh, I did a video on this one, looks like on the 11th, and um, this has been a pretty popular one. And I uh, bought a share here, I bought some more in a retirement. Um, I think I just set a limit order here and was just going to try a share, and it's uh, really taken off uh, since I bought it. Uh, but this is IPOE, this is one of uh, Chamas. Um, IPOs uh, and then I have some more information about this one uh, change in tickers and uh, some other information on it so um, as you can see uh, here on Robinhood this is the only uh, platform that I show here on the channel I just got uh, one share but um, I got more in a retirement I think for about the same cost basis I'd have to double check but um, if you don't know much about this one, uh, you can watch my other video. Uh, basically, it's a, a blank check company. Uh, it's a spec that's uh, going to be um, uh, that will change into uh, SoFi, S O F I, uh, another uh, trading platform. So, um, goes into more detail on that on my uh, other video. Uh, but again, uh, one of uh, Chamath's IPOs here, uh, average volume 4.74. Um, current volume 1.65 million and a 1.7 billion dollar uh, market cap and here you can say about mine on the uh, 12th for 14.95 and uh, this is what it's already done here just in a uh, couple days so so not too bad of a return uh, five day return of uh, 23 percent one month of uh, 20 percent almost uh, 21 percent uh, here's a little bit more uh, information about um, IPOE. Uh, so IPOE recommends shareholders vote in favor of the proposed business combination with SoFi. Um, I've had uh, SoFi the uh, trading platform. I just don't use it. I uh, got it uh, last summer. Um, the thing I didn't like about it when I first got it, it was just uh, market orders. I believe you can do uh, limit orders on it now. Uh, when I first got into it, I think I put uh, 25 or 50 dollars into it, and they gave me like 25 or 50. I can't remember which is which, but it uh, wasn't too bad. But I haven't used it all whole lot uh, just because it's uh, market orders. I don't like market orders, but um, I always do uh, limit orders. But I believe that has changed, so I need to look at it and start using it again. But um, I have a couple other uh, trading platforms that I use, so. Uh, but back to uh, IPOE. So this kind of goes over some uh, information uh, about the uh, vote in favor of the proposed business combination with uh, SoFi. Uh, the company's proxy statement dated on uh, May 7th, Extraordinary General Meeting. Uh, the Extraordinary General Meeting will be held at 12 p.m. Eastern on uh, May 27th. Uh, so a week from yesterday uh, so go ahead and put that on your uh, calendar uh, virtual via live webcast here's the uh, website IPO shareholders as of April 29 2021 the record day for the extraordinary general meeting are entitled to vote their shares either in person or by proxy card and I'm not going to read all this to you, so feel free to uh, pause and uh, go over the rest of the information here for yourself. Uh, it talks about voting online, voting by phone, uh, and you can also do by uh, mail, So, which is kind of amazing this <laughs> day and age, but um, uh, maybe it's email or emailed. Well, it looks like it is mail, so let's still people that use mail so just kind of amazing but, but uh, moving on um, IPOE reaches 1.72 billion uh, now what this is just uh, dated on the uh, 20th so uh, yesterday uh, gained 3.75 percent or 0 0.63 points at the uh, close at $17.43 with a heavy trading volume and the uh, company report on May 18th that uh, social finance technologies to trade on NASDAQ as SoFi. So that will be the uh, new ticker. So 
can't beat that can't uh, get me more simpler than that so that's what the uh, platform is called so so they announced a uh, pending transfer of a listing of its uh, class A ordinary shares uh, value per share and redeemable warrants and I'm just gonna scroll through this information if you'd like to pause and uh, go over the rest there for yourself uh, kinda talks about the warrants here uh, if we look at the average volume of 4.33 million shares IPO reached to a volume of 4,634,012 in the uh, most trading day so it's uh, becoming more traded this goes over a range performance analysts of the IPO stock or IPO E and moving on um, IPOE the stock is trading higher today and this is dated on the uh, 7th um, still some uh, relevant information in here uh, so again the uh, meeting is on uh, May 27th some of this uh, we've already uh, covered this kind of goes over what it was uh, trading about uh, two weeks ago Back by Chamath, Sofei will begin trading on the NASDAQ, and here is when. Uh, this is just an article designated to uh, that, and uh, kind of some of the uh, same information. Uh, again, we've already went over. Business combination is expected to be completed on May 28th, uh, so a week from today. And shares will be exchanged uh, one for one for Sofei shares and transferred to the NASDAQ exchange uh, social finance technology stocks is scheduled to begin trading on Tuesday June 1st uh, using the ticker SoFi so on June 1st you'll be able to trade with the uh, new ticker this kind of goes over the uh, SPAC merger the SEC concluded that the SPAC warrants uh, should be listed as liabilities on the balance sheet SoFi uh, boasts more than 1.8 million members and offers a host of personal financial services including individual loans, credit cards, home mortgages, student loans, and investing brokerage services. As part of its services, SoFi uh, provides no-cost member benefits including financial planning. Uh, so they do quite a bit of um, different services in the uh, financial services uh, fintech credit card home mortgages student loans and so on and my other video kind of goes over a little bit more in depth on uh, what they do uh, so if I will begin trading on the Nasdaq uh, well that's the uh, same article just opened up twice it looks like over here to uh, stuck twits Currently at 1845, a 52-week low of 1010, a high of 2826, and I'm in this one for the long run. Um, as you can see, the uh, difference in price, I feel it's uh, gonna run up again. So we'll see what it does. Might take a dip after the ticker change, uh, but we'll wait and see. But um, uh, as it says here, six days of green and still going strong. It's uh, done pretty well since I uh, bought in. Um, this is a sign of a unicorn uh, going public. Uh, this is a $35 stock on first day of SoFi and public uh, market. Totally a bellwether. So we'll see uh, what happens to it on the. Um, it might uh, change, might see some volatility on the uh, 27th uh, next week as well as on the 1st. We'll just have to uh, wait and see what it does after the uh, Memorial Day weekend. So. This goes over a different disruptor, so Let's see if there's any good details in here. Texas Pop is going to the moon, one bottle rocket at a time. So there's lots of potential behind this one, lots of bulls, uh, lots of people saying this one is just going to explode. So, power hour price spike pattern. 
added tier options keeping this flat it wants to break out maybe Monday uh, so maybe it will break out more on uh, Monday we'll have to wait and see so uh, if you get into this one it's gonna have some volatility as you can see so um, like I said I'm in this one for the uh, long run um, I don't know at least a year maybe two maybe five or ten just have to wait and see uh, what it does so writing upward support there you go uh, not much other information in there and nothing here on uh, tip ranks we'll check that at a uh, later time uh, but you can see what I bought into it here um, just on the uh, 12th so a little bit over a week ago and it's already uh, got a 3.46 dollar a 23 percent um, upside so not too bad I could have bought more in here I just decided not to and wanted to put it in my uh, retirement so um, I got a share here so I can kind of show what it does but as you can see 1875 um, down to uh, 1840 back up to 1869 so this one's kind of all over the place um, be kind of a fun one to trade and get the dips and some might be another plan to do that here on uh, the Robinhood account um, but trying to uh, limit my uh, funds in uh, Robinhood here and uh, get away from it um, but uh, keep it around for the channel so uh, if you have this one uh, go ahead and list it in the uh, comments and um, if you haven't smashed that like button yet, go ahead and hit that for me as well as subscribing. That would really help out the channel and hit the bell so you're notified of when the next videos drop. Again, this is Jay Money, Falling Ford Financial. Happy trading, happy investing. Stay green. Cheers.